In letter six of the Screwtape Letters by C.S. Lewis, Screwtape responds with pleasure to the news that the patient may be drafted for military service. Seeing the uncertainty this brings as a prime opportunity to sow anxiety and distance the patient from God, referred to as the enemy. Screwtape elaborates on the strategic advantage of keeping humans preoccupied with the future to the detriment of their present actions and spiritual condition. He distinguishes the enemy's desire for humans to live in the present and make decisions rooted in faith from the demonic goal of overwhelming humans with fears and hypotheticals about their future. Screwtape advises Wormwood to manipulate the patient's focus so he becomes engrossed by various and incompatible considerations of what might happen to him, thereby diverting his attention from understanding his suffering as a form of spiritual trial allowed by God. This manipulation is aimed at preventing the patient from recognizing and accepting his fears as something to be offered up or dealt with through faith, thus keeping him spiritually stagnant and more susceptible to their influences. Screwtape further instructs Wormwood on the subtle manipulation of the patient's self-awareness. When the patient engages in actions favorable to the enemy, such as acts of charity, he should be made to concentrate on his feelings of benevolence in a self-congratulatory manner rather than on the act itself or its recipient. In contrast, when the patient acts in ways that align with the devil's wishes, he should not become introspective about his emotions or motivations, thus avoiding any potential remorse or desire to change. Concerning the patient's attitude towards the war, Screwtape dismisses the usefulness of the patient's hatred towards the country's enemies, but sees potential in exploiting the feelings of malice and benevolence the war may engender in him. Wormwood is encouraged to direct the patient's malice towards those in his immediate surroundings and to limit his benevolence to abstract and distant subjects, thus preventing the formation of genuine, compassionate actions towards those he interacts with daily. Finally, Screwtape emphasizes the importance of preventing the patient from developing virtuous habits. He understands that such habits could form a steady foundation of faith and goodness that would protect the patient from their manipulations. The overarching strategy outlined in this letter is to keep the patient unbalanced and focused on himself and his fears, away from the spiritual growth and resilience that awareness, present living, and genuine charity could yield. So what did you think about this video? Please leave a comment down below and let me know what books you would like to see in the next video. Signing off, this has been another Bookly Crash Course.